Hello, I'd like to share some information with you today in regards to coping with stress at work. This information is coming from the American Psychological Association, APA. Any person that has held a job at some point has felt the pressure of work-related stress. Uh, any job can have stressful elements. In the short term, uh, a person may experience pressure to meet a particular deadline or to fulfill a challenging obligation. Uh, but when your work stress becomes chronic, it can be uh, sometimes overwhelming. You can't always avoid the tension that can occur on the job, yet you can take steps to manage the work-related stressors. So some common sources of work stress um, can be due to certain factors that uh, can tend to go hand in hand with work stressors, um, are low salary, uh, excessive workloads, lack of social support, uh, work that is not engaging or challenging, um, few opportunities for growth or investment, uh, feeling like you're not having enough control over your job related decisions and conflicting demands. This is not all encompassing. These are some examples of. So some steps to take away um, from to assist with managing stress is tracking your stressors. Possibly keep a journal for a week or two to identify which situations create the most stress and how you respond to them. Record your thoughts, feelings, and information about the environment, including the individuals involved in the circumstances, the physical setting of the environment, and um, how you reacted to those or responded to those um, stressors. Uh, for example, did you uh, raise your voice? Uh, taking notes can help you find patterns among your stressors and the way that you respond to them. Develop healthy responses. Um, possibly instead of attempting to fight the stress uh, with uh, maladaptive behavior, such as like smoking, drinking, eating ex excessive fast food, um, do your best and try, 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 try to make healthier um, choices when you feel the tension is rising. Um, if you're able to exercise, uh, again, with in COVID, kind of social distancing, um, do that. Whether that is yoga, whether that is any type of form of physical activity, that can be of benefit. Also, you want to keep in mind to make time for hobbies. Um, for like activities that you enjoy. Uh, get enough quality good food as well as quality sleep. Those are important because they are uh, effective with managing stress. Establish boundaries. Uh, in today's world, it's easy to feel the pressure to be available 24 hours a day. Establish some work-life boundaries for yourself. That might mean making a rule not to check your email as much from home in the evening and or not um, answering the phone during dinner. Those are examples. Take time to recharge. To avoid the negative effects of chronic stress and burnout, uh, we need to replenish ourselves, have a reset if you will, uh, and return to our pre-stress level functioning. Uh, the recovery process with this and the switch off, if you will, um, by having periods of times when you're neither engaging in work-related activities nor thinking about work. Uh, it can be critical at times to dis disconnect from time to time in ways that fits your needs and your preferences. When you're able to not take time off, get a quick boost of turn off time from your smartphone and focus on um, non-work activities. Also learning how to relax. Techniques such as meditation, deep breathing exercises and, med and mindfulness, excuse me. And keeping in mind that mindfulness is a state in which that you actively kind of observe the present experiences and thoughts without judging them. Uh, those can help with managing stress or stressors. Start by taking a couple of minutes a day to focus on simple activities like breathing, walking, enjoying a meal. 
Uh, this skill definitely takes practice and it can assist with focusing on purposeful um, activities without distraction um, so that you can kind of hone in and strengthen your, um, your, your coping skills, if you will. So getting some support also is of importance. Accepting help from trusted friends, family members can also assist you in managing those stressors. Um, also definitely keep in mind that your employer may also have some stress manage management resources available through the employee assistance program. Um, also, there may be counseling, uh, mental health uh, providers that can be uh, referred to. Um, and I always kind of go to, if those things are not uh, available for you, definitely please, you can look up um, prescribers online um, and place your zip code and contact the, the provider directly to see if, um, they have any openings or talk about their practice and things of that nature. It is important um, to kind of have support um, from an unbiased place that can help you or assist you with processing your thoughts and feelings and manage um, stressors and unhealthy maladaptive um, behaviors. So I hope this information was of assistance for you, and I hope that you enjoy the remainder of your day.